High school teacher put on leave after officials discover her OnlyFans account. A high school teacher in Missouri has been suspended after officials discovered her OnlyFans account. English teacher Brianna Coppage, 28, has since said that she knew the risks of setting up an OnlyFans profile. Coppage said that she started the account as a way to support her household in addition to her salary as a teacher. She explained that on average her OnlyFans would bring in around $8,000 to $10,000 per month. This was on top of her annual teacher's salary of about $42,000. Coppage had been teaching at St. Clair High School in Franklin County for two years, and said that she had been expecting to be discovered eventually. The Missouri teacher told the St. Louis Post-Dispatch, It was kind of always like this cloud hanging over my head, like I never knew when I would be discovered. Then, about two weeks ago, my husband and I were told that people were finding out about it. So I knew this day was coming. Coppage said that she chose OnlyFans as a platform to post her content as she believed that it would offer a degree of protection, as users must subscribe with a credit card to view content. She believes that a recent video in which she and her husband collaborated with two popular performers in St. Louis may have been the source of her discovery. The 28-year-old claimed she had a meeting with two school administrators and was confronted about posting inappropriate media on one or more internet sites. Coppage said, There is this expectation that teachers should be the moral leaders of students, and I do not disagree with that. I taught the curriculum. I taught students reading and writing, and I didn't guide them on my thoughts or beliefs, and I can't control what people think of me. She added that she doesn't regret her decision to join the platform. I'm very aware that I am probably never going to teach again, but that was kind of the risk I knew I was taking. I am sad about that. I do miss my students, Coppage said. Coppage was clear that her online persona is entirely separate from her work, and that she never made any content on school grounds. Superintendent Kyle Cruz said that the school had hired legal counsel to investigate if the content Coppage shared impacted her employment at the school. He said, Actions taken as a result of the investigation will be in accordance with board policy and with guidance from legal counsel. For her part, Coppage insists that her posts were not illegal, and that she doesn't think that, sex work has to be shameful, but, does wish things just happened in a different way, what do you think? Post a comment below.